Hi, uh, welcome back. Um, I mentioned when I was setting up the uh, K-Stars that it would also work from uh, Sky Safari. Um, what I've got here is BlueStack, which you can download, and that's like a Windows um, portal, if you like, for, uh, for you know controlling the Android. It's an Android um, plugin. And from this, you can also, uh, you can also run ASI Air from that as well. Um, what I'm looking at though is I've just opened up Sky Safari on here and uh, what I'm looking at doing is configuring it as discussed um, so that it can connect up to the um, Raspberry Pi um, Astro Berry. To do that we click on settings once we've opened it up we come down to telescope setup and it's already pretty much on that page for me probably because that's where I was last in. <laughs> anyway what you want to do is you come down to connect via Wi-Fi and you enter in your IP address down there, that's mine. And then do you remember that number I told you to keep an eye on, that make a metal note on the 9624, that goes in there. And then once you've got that done, that should then interface with um, Sky Safari. So whatever you choose to do here, should then um, emulate on AstroBerry um, on your Pi. Again, I haven't done this in anger yet. That's only theoretically how it's done. And I realise it's probably a bit cheeky of me to do this without testing it first. But I thought, well, you know, the configuration can be done in cloudy skies and in daylight. As you can see where I'm sitting now, it's, uh, it's in daylight. So I thought I'd share that with you. And yeah, um, I'll share any successes and, and, um, and I invite you to do the same thing. Um, Hope that bit of extra has been of use to you and uh, thank you for watching.